Accept our praise and worship in the name of Jesus. Please, if you have a testimony, you go back there and write down your name. Hallelujah. If you have a testimony, this month of May, the Lord has put the world of darkness under my feet. By the power of light, every works of the darkness over your life. Today, you will put them under your feet in the name of Jesus. Let's open our Bible. First Thessalonians chapter 5. I read from 16. We're going to be thanking God for the grace that we give it to us to be here this morning. Hallelujah. In verse 16, say, Rejoice evermore. Pray without ceasing in everything. Give thanks for this is will of God in Christ Jesus concerning you. Hallelujah. In everything, give thanks to God. In Psalm 118, verse 23, it says, This is the Lord's doing, and it's marvelous in our eyes. We're going to lift up our voice and begin to thank God for all He has done, for His marvelous works in our life. Lift up your voice and begin to pray in the name of Jesus. Father, thank you for your marvelous work in our life. Father, we thank you. We give you all the glory. We give you all the honor. Father, we thank you. We have come this morning to thank you. We have come this morning to return all the glory to you for preserving our life, for guiding us, for going out and coming, for sleeping and wake up. Father, we thank you. We give you all the glory. Jesus, thank you. Jesus, thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. This is lost day, and it's marvelous in our life, and it's marvelous. Father, thank you for your marvelous work. Father, thank you by every cell, by strength, no man prevail. By strength, no man prevail. You are alive this morning. It's not by your own power, neither by your strength, but it's by the mercy of God. It's by the grace of God. Father, thank you for your loving kindness. Father, thank you. For your faithfulness, Father, thank you for who you are. Father, thank you for what you are going to do in this first service. Father, thank you for fighting my battle. Father, thank you. I return all the glory to you. Mashakata, Ella Kabana Gate, Ella Kashakata, Ella Kabana Gata, Ella Kashakata, Ella Kabana Gata. Lift up your voice and begin to pray. Jesus, we thank you. Father, thank you. Father, thank you for your marvelous work in our life, in our family, in the VGC, for healing, for the testimony, for the sense of wonder, for your blessings upon our life. Father, we thank you. We give you all the glory. We turn all the glory to you. We are grateful, Jesus. I am grateful, oh Lord. I am grateful, Jesus. I am grateful, Jesus. I am grateful, Jesus. I am grateful, Jesus, for all you are doing for me. Father, thank you. For in Jesus' name. We are praying. Amen. We are praying. We can see pray better. In Psalm 2, verse 8. Psalm 2, verse 8. It says, Ask of me, and I shall give thee the hidden for their inheritance, and the uttermost part of the earth for their possession. Today, you will possess all that belongs to you in the name of Jesus. Amen. So we're going to be asking God, we're going to be receiving power and fire to possess the abundance of God over this month of May. Hallelujah. So be praying. Father, in the name of Jesus, O oh God of all grace, I receive the baptism of power and fire to possess the abundance of God over this month of May. Pray in the mighty name of Jesus, I receive the baptism of power and fire to possess the abundance of God over this month of May. In the name of Jesus, I receive it now. I receive power. I let up a kata. I let us a kate. Ela kapa lata. Enda leta shakata. Ela kabaragato. Malaka sakato. Malaka sagadagada. I receive power. I receive fire. To possess what belongs to me. I receive power. I receive fire. To take what belongs to me. 
in the name of Jesus, and it's a power, and it's a fire to put through, to succeed, to take over, to take charge in the name of Jesus. Lift up your voice and begin to ask God for power, power to put through, power to possess the abundance of God over this matter. May power to succeed, power to make it in life. My Lord, it is God that gives power to get wet. Begin to ask God for that power, power to get wet, power to possess what belongs to you, the abundance of God over this world. I receive power, I receive the battles of power. My Lord, 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 this month of May, it will not pass. On to deliver my blessing. On to deliver what belongs to me. In the name of Jesus. My Lord, 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 my Thank you, Lord. By Jesus' name, we are praying. We are going to be asking, Father, let your presence be evidence over this service, this first service. Hallelujah. So we pray, Father, in the name of Jesus. Oh God of all grace, let your presence accompany us in this first service. Pray the mighty name of Jesus. Father, we ask for your presence in the name of Jesus. Let your presence take over. Let your presence take over. Allah kashakata barakato. Allah kata leka. Ela kosa kata barakato. Malaka shakata leka te. Ela kapa lato lalakato. Maka. Oh God of all grace, we ask for your presence. Let your presence take over. You are present to hear the shade. You are present to deliver the press. You are present to do signs and wonders. Let our presence be released in our midst. In the name of Jesus. Lift up your voice and begin to pray. Begin to ask God for his presence. Allah ka baraka ta kate, Allah ka baraka ta kato, Allah ka shaka ta lagata, Allah ka baraka ta kato, Allah ka shaka ta baraka ta, Allah ka baraka ta lagato, Allah ka shaka ta kata kata, Allah ka baraka ta kata kato, Allah ka shaka ta kato, Allah ka shaka ta lagata, Allah ka baraka ta kata. Oh God of all grace, let your presence take over, let your presence take over. What is the love that's left? To receive power, let your power take over, let your presence take over over the first service to hear the sick, to deliver the press, to do sense and wonder and amaze. Thank you, Lord, for in Jesus' name we are praying. Amen. Hallelujah. I'm going to be praying, I'm going to be receiving power to destroy the works of the devil over the day and over this week. And the month of May. Hallelujah. Amen. In First John, in First John chapter 3, verse 8, he said, He that committed sin is of the devil. For the devil sinned from the beginning. For this purpose, the Son of God was manifested that he may destroy the works of the devil. Every works of the devil over your life be destroyed in the name of Jesus. Amen. So we're going to be praying. Father, in the name of Jesus. Oh God of all grace. I receive power to destroy the works of the devil over the days. Please. And in this month of May, pray the mighty name of Jesus. I receive power to destroy the works of the devil. I receive power to destroy the works of the devil over the days. The weeds in this week. Every works of the devil. Every manipulation of the devil over my life. Over my family, be destroyed by fire, be destroyed by fire, be destroyed by fire. My shaka tokata for this purpose, the Son of God was manifested that He may destroy the works of the devil, that He may destroy the sickness, that He may destroy the poverty, that He may destroy the hardship, that He may destroy all of the pit of hell. I receive power to destroy the works of the devil. I receive power to destroy the works of the devil. In today, in this day, in this week, be destroyed by fire, be scattered by fire. My shakata kato, my kata kata kata, aleka ba aleka to, ela kasa kata kata, la kasa kata kata, ela kada bara kata, le kasa la kata, ela kada bara kata kata, le kasa kata kata, le kapa la kate, ela kasa kato, my 
Aleka takato kato Araka da balagata Meka sakata Eleka kato Na shaka palagato Thank you Lord For in Jesus name We are praying Amen In Genesis 21 verse 19 Genesis 21 verse 19 And God opened her eyes And she saw a well of water Today God will deliver your blessings In the name of Jesus this week, God will favor you in the mighty name of Jesus. And she went and filled the bottles with water and gave lad drink. Hallelujah. Whatever that belongs to you, it will, God will open your eyes to see them in the name of Jesus. So we're going to be praying. We're going to be asking God of all grace. Open my eyes to see my well of blessings and revelation. Abundant, faithful, and breakthrough. Hallelujah. So we pray. Father, in the name of Jesus. Oh, God of all grace. Open my eyes in this service. To see my well of blessings and revelation. By the mighty name of Jesus. Oh, God of all grace. Open my eyes today. Open my eyes in this first service. Open my eyes. To see my word of blessings and revelation, abundant, breakthrough, opportunity in the name of Jesus. Open my eyes, my katakata. Open my eyes, Lord. Somebody's praying. Lord, open my eyes to see my well of opportunity. Open my eyes in this service as your word will be coming forth. Let my eyes be open. I want to see beyond the ordinary. Let my eyes be open, Lord. Somebody pray. Pray with understanding. Pray with revelation. Let my eyes be open of what to do. That will change my story. Let my eyes be open, Lord. I don't want to remain the same. Open my eyes, oh Lord. Open my eyes, oh Lord. Open my inner eyes. Let me behold wondrous things out of your world. As a comfort to me, let me not return the same. Let my life not remain the same, Lord. Open my eyes. I want to see beyond the ordinary. Open my eyes to mysteries. Open my eyes to revelation. Open my eyes to the depth in your world. Open my eyes to life. Father, thank you. Blessed be your name forever. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. I have no doubt in my heart that somebody will live here blessed. That which God has ordained right from the foundation of the earth concerning your life in this service, I see every one of them coming to pass in the name of Jesus Christ. The blessings that is in the presence of the Lord, I see it becoming your portion. You are living here strengthened and empowered in the name of Jesus. You are living as another man. You are living as another woman. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Thank you, Heavenly Father. In Jesus' name, we oh pray. The Lord bless you, please. You may be seated. We give God all praise and glory for another opportunity to be in God's presence. The reason why we must never stop thanking him is because the life we have is not our own. David said, I slept, I woke up in Psalm 3, for the Lord sustained me. The reason why we are here is because God kept us. And we must never stop giving him thanks. I pray God Almighty that has ordered your step into his vineyard this morning. We do the extraordinary for you in the name of Jesus Christ. I call on the following names as they share their testimony. This is Blessed and Etie, Brother Akogo Isaac. Put your hands together for Jesus. Once I was blind and now I can see. Glory to God. Praise the Lord. I really want to appreciate the name of the King of Glory for his mercy, for divine health, for divine provision. There is this thing I've been believing God concerning my business to have a center here in Shasha. And for me to have that, I must have up to like 1.5 million to 2 million. But I want to appreciate the name of the Most High God for his favor, all the instruments I needed for it, 
God is giving it to me at ease. I want to appreciate the name of the Lord because I'll be at the comfort of my home. Everything is just working to me. And I want to bless the name of the Lord now. I can, be start, I can start my seminar. Hallelujah. I can run tests for people. Thank I can God. use machine for people. Thank I say God of grace who has done this for me. May his name alone be glorified. Amen. Put your hands together for Jesus. What a powerful testimony. You remember the sacrifice that was called for. There is a prophetic word attached to that sacrifice. God said. God said. God said. And I'm quoting him. That which you want to do with the money you have wherever that you, maybe in the bank account or wherever you saved it. He said, bring it and I will do your own for you. We had her. She obeyed and did her own part of that sacrifice. And today, that which would have come money is an encouragement to somebody. Glory to God. And I pray in the name of Jesus, everyone who has the habit of sharing testimony, you will keep having more in the name of Jesus Christ. And for those of us that will be turning a new leaf from today, I decree also that our testimony will keep rolling in the name of Jesus Christ. I'd like us to listen to the following announcement and be blessed as you do in Jesus' name. And when I say it's a communion and fasting service, and we are all encouraged to be in the presence of the Lord. By 6 p.m., we'll all be here. I pray for you in the name of Jesus. You will not see trouble. That will, which will make you be running at a scatter. I decree this year, 2022, will never be your portion. In the name of Jesus Christ. Every time we come to the presence of God, we are coming to draw strength. We are coming to be empowered. We are coming to receive divine protection. We are coming to receive help from above. The help that cannot be compared to the help of man. So please, let's not limit our worship to God to Sunday, Sunday. It is not healthy. You know, many times we keep saying this to people. And then for those who feel that, hey, I'm busy, I'm busy. God knows you are busy. But the truth of the matter is that the person who is in the grave cannot say he's busy. David was speaking. He said, Lord, the dead cannot praise you. It is the man, the woman who is alive that can praise him. So please, I know we are busy people. I know we want to achieve more in our life. I understand that. We have so many responsibilities around us. I know that. But the truth of the matter is that the place of God, the place of God, the service of God can never be overemphasized. Let's make sure that we make it a time with God. Yesterday, I wanted to get something and then that cost a very huge amount of money. I called the fellow. I wanted to send my children. But I decided to call the fellow before sending my children. Do you know that when I called this woman, she told me, Madam, I'm on my way to the church. I told her, she asked me what I wanted to buy. I told her that what thousands of naira. She said, I'm on my way. <laughs> I believe the some of us say, Madam, where are you there now? I want to reverse. Praise the Lord. I pray that that which belongs to you will not pass you. And that singular act made me not to go somewhere else to buy. I decided on Monday I will go and buy from her. Praise the Lord. So please, our time with God, in, you know, on a weekly basis, we have just one service in a week. Let's not be too busy. The Lord will help us in the name of Jesus Christ. And also this Saturday, 7 a.m. is our general evangelism. And we are all encouraged also to be in the church as we all go out to win souls for God. I pray as you do that, the Lord will continue to bless you in the name of Jesus Christ. And this also is a good news for our children. This Saturday by 3 p.m. is another time, our children prayer meeting. In fact, ever since we stopped it, they have been complaining seriously. Seriously, they have been complaining. But this Saturday is your time. I hope they are hearing me. Glory to God. So parents, let's take that also at that as we bring our children 3 p.m. this Saturday. And I pray our lives will never remain the same in Jesus' name. After the service, there's Grace Academy and 5 p.m. house fellowship meeting. Let's put our hands together for Jesus. Mighty, mighty is our God. Glory to God. It's time to honor God with our tithes. Please, you have your tithe there. Come very quickly as you lift it up declaring the words of prayer.
Father, thank you for this Titus. We are grateful for your provision over their life. Thank you for your help over their life. Thank you for favor. Thank you for goodness. Thank you for your mercy that I've given them this. Father, we give you all the glory. We give you all the honor. Lord, receive this tithe from them. Let their lives not remain the same. Let help come their way. Let favor come their way. Let their doors be open. Let, oh God, difficulty give way in the name of Jesus. Let favor locate their lives. Father, thank you. And every expectation, even as they are declaring unto you, Father, do it for them, Lord, in the name of God the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Please drop your tithe very quickly. Let's take our offering. We'll be giving it to the Lord as we celebrate Jesus this morning. Take your offering. You want to make use of the uh, transfer? Please do that very quickly. Father, thank you for all this tithe in our hands. We give you all the glory. This offering, please everyone be standing. Father, thank you for this offering. Lord, receive it from our hands. In the name of Jesus, we ask for help. We ask for favor to come our way in the name of Jesus. Let this offering ascend to you, O God, as a sweet-smelling savour. And in return, let your blessing be established in our lives. Father, thank you because you have done it. Blessed be your name forever. In Jesus' mighty name, O prayer. All I have is given to me by the Lord. All I have is given to me by the Lord. All I have is given to me by the Lord. As he give the Lord, we bless you. As he give the Lord, I say, as he give the Lord, we bless you. As he give the Lord, oh, as he give the Lord, we bless you. As he give the Lord, the Lord we bless you. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. What makes the altar those church altar those is silent. They are very close to the grave. Obedience is one of the instruments that give people access to God's blessing. When he say clap for Jesus, nobody is bigger than Jesus. Okay, clap for Jesus. <laughs> Hallelujah. When you say praise the Lord, who are you praising? Okay, praise the Lord. You will not cry in the place of praise. It is better to be happy in God's presence than to be happy when you're in trouble. One of our brother here, his brother is in the in captive now in the hand of book, uh, kidnappers, demanding huge amount of money and beating every money. Without shirt, without uh, without food. There are many of us until we go through a hard way before we will thank God. Is a crime to many people. Obedience is one of the major instruments in the hand of believers to win its battle. Devil use it against us. 
So when they said, clap for those who are coming for testimony, you did your hand like this, and God said, let me see when your testimony will come. Because you have no clap for me as the giver of the testimony. Let's learn how to celebrate. The Bible said, weeping may endure for a night, but joy. Your joy will not be stolen. Amen. If you sleep on the wrong side of the bed, tell the devil, I won't be on the wrong side. Somebody make a joyful noise to the Lord. Amen. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Put that uh, court, please. This is my month of what? The works of darkness have been put under my feet by the power of light. Those of you that say Jesus is the light of the world, darkness works shall be put under your feet. You're going to take this prayer before we sit down. He disappointed the devices of the crafty so that their hand cannot perform their enterprises. He took the wise in his own craftiness and the counsel of the forwardness is taken headlong. You're going to say disappoint every devices of the wicked. From today, you didn't hear me at all say, Father, disappoint every devices of the devil. That their hand will not perform their enterprises over my life. Shout it again, say, Father. Disappoint today. Destroy today. Every activities of the wicked. Try to find fulfillment in my life. Be destroyed, be destroyed, be destroyed. Lift up your voice and pray. Nagaboko shata bakatayanaba. Open your mouth and talk to God. Open your mouth and talk to God. Lord Jesus. Are you praying or you are shaking your head? Thank you, Father. In Jesus' precious name, we pray. Amen. You're going to say, Father, redeem me from famine. 